Hey guys, I got an HTC HD2 right here running an energy ROM. Right here it has the HD mini slide to unlock bar. And as you can see, it's a very customized build. Um, it doesn't look a little different from stock because I haven't really messed with it so far. But as you can probably notice that the start menu button is down here now instead of up at the top. There's a lot more color in the notification bars. There's something called an arc switch, which is a little task manager type thing, I guess. And scrolling is pretty standard, it's all normal. Um, the cool thing about it is you can start customizing your home screen, just slide it along, just keep sliding it. Or if you want, you can just slide it up, opens your app menu, or you can just use the conventional start menu. And in here they have what's called a rotate screen. All you gotta do is click it. It rotates the screen and turns it into landscape mode. Let's see, let's just exit and go to the home screen. And here you can just slide it. Just add any application you want to it. Just choose your program. Let's rotate it back. Okay, what you see here is just an just um, just a whole bunch of smaller icons. I didn't really mess with it or install any other applications on it. Uh, let's go to tool. There's a whole bunch of other little applications here you can mess with, like registry editor, um, Wi-Fi router. You can turn your HD2 into a wireless router. And let's see. BSB tweaks, which allows you to customize your um, HD2 even further by um, here's um, some camera editing options. Um, you can t actually turn on the wireless end capability on through BSB tweaks right here through connections, wireless ends right here. You can turn it on, turn it off. I have noticed that there is a good um, improvement of wireless capabilities from my Wi-Fi. And let's exit. And Opera is running amazingly on this phone. Multi-touch is all normal. You can customize it even more. Everything's standard on the Opera Mobile part. And you can customize anything in here. Um, let's see. Personalize. You can customize those home screen tabs like right here. You can add or get rid of any tabs you don't like. Everything's a lot more colorful than it originally was. And there is access to free apps, and I haven't installed that yet, but... But there is, uh, once you do flash it, you can get free apps. Games are there, Teeter is there, usually it's an unlocked. You have to flash your phone for this, I think. Yeah. Everything is running very smoothly. Your mail is all there. It's easy, basically, push to email. Total Commander is pretty. Total Commander is pretty much gives you access to everything in the phone. So far, it's been running very smoothly. I haven't had any lag in it. You have your FM radio, audio booster, camera, 
voice recorder, Windows Media Player. And there is a lot of customization in this. It's a really good um, ROM to be running, very stable. Haven't had any crashes so far. And that's just a quick overview of Energy's Windows Mobile 6.5X ROM.